Welcome to the Pony Podcast, or whatever this is. Um, I would I would do introductions, but you can see everyone's name on there. Um, so yeah, hi everybody. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Hey. Welcome Evening. to the podcast, where we all are fun and cool and hip, and just all around amazing. We are. Um, we're. Vi- Did someone just die? Yeah. I just heard someone <laughs> scream. <laughs> I just heard someone scream from across the house and then like a loud bang. They're probably fine. Continue. <laughs> so is everybody today. It's been a while since the last Pony podcast. A long while. I feel yeah. happy that it's started up again. Yeah. I, I, I'll, I'll be honest. I kind of felt guilty because like I kept saying, oh yeah, we'll start it back eventually. Yeah. Still gonna start it and at some point. I, <laughs> my me with the, thing me, finally came through. <laughs> me with game night. <laughs> oh my but God. I have an that actual like reason. My current ever. walls are not up. I don't have any walls. I'm See, literally in a basement with frames. <laughs> See, I had a reason, but that reason has long since expired, and I still just kept not doing it. <laughs> 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 well, welcome to the Pony Podcast, everyone. Hi, I'm Basic. So I guess I'm we are like doing introductions. Cool <laughs> <laughs> yes, but like, I'm like super cool. And Except like amazing, guess, like... and like Craig will tell you all about it. <laughs> <laughs> I guess I'll go next. I see you, Craig. Hello. Hello, everyone. I'm Jay Watchcraft, and I'm just an awesome dude. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Who's I'm next? Bob and Fire. Um, I am just starting with voice acting, so yay! Um, by the way, Craig, please quit DM messaging. <laughs> <laughs> People are gonna have no idea what we're even talking about. Just turn off their phone and put it away. Excuse me, I'm Craig is the thing for basic, and Bob is the middleman. <laughs> <laughs> Right. I'm Persa Kitty, and I'm a huge pain in the butt. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sad. No, I'm sad. Fair enough, fair <laughs> enough. I'm, I'm um, going to drink to that. <laughs> drink guess... some water to that. Some good H2O. Some dihydrogen monoxide. <laughs> some good aqua. <laughs> well, I guess that leaves me. Um, Hi, I'm Safi. I do audio stuff. I'm also apparently a dragon. And a gay boy. Oh, and some other people that don't probably, matter. We should, and I we should probably introduce what characters we play still. Yeah, well, I mean... We should. We, uh, I mean, it's it's kind of obvious with the names. See, we're going to spend so much time on introduction, nothing's going to happen. Okay? And they can see our names. And, and yeah. technically, we voice more characters than that, or at least I do. Is everyone else's accurate? Mm, yeah. Yes. Kind of. Oh yeah, yeah. I forgot. Yeah. Three extra. Sorry. <laughs> Wait, you're a total of five people, right? Yes. He's all dads. I think we collectively. Korea. I think the two of us collectively voice all the dads. I I voice all the gays. So I just got Desert Rose. Is he a dad? I don't think he is. No, nope. no. Desert Rose. He is a Desert Rose. Guy. Yeah, he's a main character. He's like star. He's like a, he's a star heart. He's like I know he's that like, much. I know that much. Sean, Sean, October dreams. Sean is your dad. Sean is my. Oh no. <laughs> Sean is uh, Desert Rose's dad. Hi, daddy. You don't, you, don't, you aren't you aren't a dad. You are you are the son of a dad. <laughs> I'm the you son of a dad. dad. <laughs> when I guess all the main characters don't really have um aren't really parents, you know. That just goes to show how little I know about the actual plot of this. <laughs> <laughs> we know enough to be like I. I do all the behind the scenes stuff. You think I know about the plot? Me too. I'm one of the I writers. Only know voice actors. And, I, and I need help half the time trying to figure out what's supposed to happen. <laughs> See, like, out of all of us, out of all of us, Jacob should know the most. He's on the writing team. <laughs> See, Max and Maeve hey, were I'm... um. <laughs> They were doing- I, I don't know whether or not I'm supposed to say this, but right now I'm tr- I'm writing season three. <laughs> Ooh. 
We're up and, and I'm only up to episode three, and I've just stopped because just too much information is in my head. <laughs> Jeez, I know I know very little. I may have to pick your brain to like collect knowledge at some point, but we're gonna do that later. So not, See, not only that, but also like just I'm just gonna give Max a break in regards to like just getting too many questions, <laughs> like too many answers I need to get from him. Like, what's supposed to happen here? <laughs> At least we've gone from literally every single cast uh, and crew member being like, hey, hey, Max, hey, Max, hey, Max, to now it's only like some key people who are constantly like, hey, Max, hey, Max, hey, Max. Everyone else is like, hey, Safi, hey, Safi, hey, Maeve, hey, 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 Chris. <laughs> well, I think it's better that way because they have to be going, hey, somebody. So better to like divvy it out. <laughs> I'm like, the only, I'm, I'm like the only. We need a we need a dedicated <laughs> person for the lore. We need a dedicated person um, for lore related questions. That's what we need. I know, right? Hey, 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 basic. Hey, basic. There you go. <laughs> hey. Yeah. Yeah. I'm now Maeve. No, I am now Maeve. Everyone, I am everyone, now officially taken no. the title of Maeve. <laughs> if you let me, can if you let me finish my sentence. Everyone mostly goes to the guys. So I gotta be the one to say, "Hey, Maeve. Hey, Basic. I gotta at you, girls, homies." Yes. <laughs> Word. <laughs> Dog life. <laughs> oh my god! I remember. Here's here's the funny thing. Um, the other day when um Max and Maeve were going through and doing all of like the interviews of people and their characters and whatnot, we got to like one question when they were doing me, and it said. Okay, so, because, like, it was just for uh, Desert Rose, because he's the main character. Uh, they It wasn't relevant for all the others. But they they were like, okay, so what kind of different uh, ideas do you have for your character? Like, what kind of new things can you bring to the table for a character? And I'm like, well, I know he's gay. <laughs> <laughs> and they're like, okay, well, since you got the character, like, a few days ago, um, we'll let that slide. But everyone else needs to, like, actually have an answer. And then I'm like, Yay! Will do they know? <laughs> it wouldn't have mattered. <laughs> it wasn't they, until. They, okay. So in our interview, they did the same thing because I voiced Moon Dancer and Sunny Days, which are also two main characters. Oh, Spike too. <laughs> and um, wait, you're like, like, so what kind of what, what? What would you bring to your characters? And I'm like, gay. <laughs> Needs to be more gay. <laughs> They're the homosexuals. We had the realization the other day that wait, what what was it? Like everyone except Chrissy, right, Basic? Oh, everyone? All all the ever, everyone except like all all your admins are all like not straight. <laughs> except Chris. Except Chris, Chris. Is, Chrissy is the Chrissy is the only straight homo like She's homo the only straight <laughs> cis person. <laughs> Everyone else is by Everyone some means queer. The... Yep. Is there anyone? Welcome to the Welcome to the Pony Podcast. <laughs> Welcome to My Little Pony TLG. <laughs> Where everybody here is gay. See, and I'll have you know. The minority is a straight. <laughs> the minority. No. That's the thing. The in this project, I swear. Generation. <laughs> Now, the real question is, how many people are attracted to pans? I mean, I know I am. <laughs> Ooh, them pans. Have you really looked at a nice look? Like, have you ever, like, looked at a crock pot? Ooh, I like me like, good. Come on. You can't, you can't. Don't lie to me, honey. Don't lie. Good crock pot. I'm going to do something dangerous. Really? I'm going to do something dangerous. Oh, no. Oh, oh no. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm gonna be careful about my search terms. I actually, I actually had, I actually had those, uh, those pans at one point. Those, those orange pans. Which orange pants? Mm, those are some nice pans. I know, right? <laughs> mm. They were non-stick too. Ooh. Nothing stuck on them, but they burned. That's um, very useful. Really bad. All right, let's okay. let's move on before this gets very dangerous. <laughs> Please. Please. Ooh, it's already dangerous. <laughs> All right, all right, all right. Good to be hearing this. All right, so let's the go pants. through the questions. And, you know, for comedic effect, let's pretend like I haven't gone through them already. Because it's funnier hey. that way. 
Okay, so questions. Here, here's some stuff. I also haven't gone through them already either. You're the one who sent or... them to me. <laughs> Same. <laughs> You're the one who sent them to me. <laughs> I'm innocent in all of this. Himself did not know the question. <laughs> I get. As I a mean, famous it's... character would say, ironic. It's supposed to be quality control. You literally just copy and paste them and not even look. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> all right. Well, let's Percy go. Percy sent me some things, and I'm like, Percy sent me some things, and I'm like, oh, okay, sounds good. <laughs> You're welcome. All right, all right. Let me look. Let me look through this list. Okay. Um, let's see, so some questions. Okay. Um, our favorite, if we have one, our favorite what? <laughs> character, I guess? It should be there, is it not? I don't know. Your favorite character. Who are you, you not? I'm going to assume let characters. Let get on that document. But, yeah. Uh, uh, Where are you? I'm looking at, it's in the podcast chat. Oh. Okay. Okay. Um, my brain is slow. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I think it would be favorite moments. Favorite. You know what? That's fine. Favorite moments. Okay. Discussing favorite. Oh wait, no, that's the next one. Okay. Play. Oh, maybe there's characters. Would your character do this? What would your like, character what would... do? That one's yeah. gonna be fun. We're gonna have to do some. Okay. That is. Is there a <laughs> line you do? Walmart. Is there a line you do to get into character? Oh boy. <laughs> How'd you find the project? We did that one last time. <laughs> okay, um, if you have to pick a favorite character, that's not one it's you not boys. <laughs> All right, well, let's, let's start simple. Okay, is there a line you, ha you do to get into character? Yep. Who are we, we going to start with? Oh, yeah, definitely. Okay. I think we should go down there the is. line. Me? I guess I'll start then. All right. Oh wait, no, basic, you're at the top. Basic. Oh, alphabetical. Um, is it? The line, okay, so whenever I do it's moon, moon, moon Dancer. Moon Butt. It's kind of just Moon Butt. 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 And then I just get to this point and I'm just like, it's just, just fine. I'm gonna pretend like I, I understood to... what you said. <laughs> I, I'm a moon dancer. Hi. Um, my butt is this. <laughs> my my mane is this. Um, I don't know what else to say. Your butt. I'm tired. Hey, can you say um, sun butt? Just put the picture of her up. Just just say sun butt. Hey sun butt. Um, <laughs> how are you? It's thank you. Nice to see you. Thank sun you. butt. Sun buddy. Um, what else? Uh, sunny days. For sunny days, I'm still working on sunny days' voice, but um, her voice is kind of more brass, kind of more chill, kind of what's up, man? Uh, I just, you know, just like that, I go, what's up? Or you can't be serious, right? <laughs> um, what? And then for Grandman, I get an old lady kind of voice, kind of. <laughs> And she kind of kind of talks like this, and then she kind of talks, and she's like spearmint fresh. No, that's the line I do. Spearmint fresh, nice. and then spike, <laughs> and then spike. I don't know. It just hey, what's up? I'm Spike. Um, I guess I'm kind of just chill here. Um, it's all just kind of weird and new and hi. It sounded like Ash Ketchum. Do you point out earlier? Exactly. Exactly. Like I told you. Gotta catch them Pikachu, I choose you. Oh my Please. god. Pikachu, Please. I choose you. Thank you. Oh, Thank that's, you. The, that's nostalgic. I needed that. I needed that. Thank you. I need a bot. I need a drink of water. Spike is one character that hurts. <laughs> Try singing for Cherry Blossom. Hang those high notes in her voice. No! Try singing a spike. Oh, gotta sound like a dragon, but also gotta sound like your child. So, anyways, going down the line. Bob and how do you do cotton candy? 
Okay, um, so I just do like a kind of more high-pitched voice and kind of sweet sounding. Hi guys, I'm Cotton Candy. Originally when I had to do her voice, um, I would just use the one line I used to audition for her where it's like, our brother, Polynesis, lies unburied on the ground. <laughs> Make sure I get the right <laughs> voice. It's like, hi. Cherry Blossom, please quit going to jail. <laughs> Right, Sammy? Besides, Sammy has stacks! Shut up. Just You're you're on time out right now. Just <laughs> sit down. Think of what we did. I really could not give a flying care about what you think. Twenty days, I'm so sorry, but <laughs> Just, just go. I'm just go, so honestly. <laughs> just go. She's... This is this is the first time or the last time she'll be here, so... <laughs> See you tomorrow! Same time to... Same time! Yeah. I'll drink to that. I'll bring some you some nice aqua. Time. I'm sorry. <laughs> bring some... I didn't bring any drink. popcorn. <laughs> <laughs> No, like I mentioned Sherry's there so much that she knows everything about the guards. Like, hey, Frank, how's the wife? <laughs> oh my god. Like, like she comes in there, they're like, oh my like, oh no, it's not Sherry again. Speaking of which, what are you doing in my room? Get out. Like, oh now I get two of them. And both cats just came in my room. Wonderful. I'm gonna, I'm gonna I'm gonna pull something spicy real quick. We're, oh, gonna, no. we're gonna up Wait. the bit rate and hope nothing bad happens. <laughs> Wait. All right, Percy. What what line do you do to get into your characters? <clears throat> uh, let's see. For Rainbow, it's oh, cause obviously I first auditioned for Spring Parade, so hers was darling. Max had to go up an octave, and it'd be perfect for Rainbow. So I have to do darling, darling, and then minty. <laughs> I, I I have to do minty. What? And then minty. minty. <laughs> Yeah, from the, from the first episode I ever recorded as her. Like, the, the first line. <laughs> usually, I hear usually the first line a voice actor records or, like, auditions for is a line that they use to get into character. <laughs> you're right, you're right. For it's, it's it's honestly for, wrong. For Kim, yeah. it's her name. Cherry Blossom! Precious, let's see, Precious Gem. <clears throat> obviously, like, obviously you gotta be calm, and then Oh, hello, Starlight. That's, and then Desert Blossom. Hers is come on up, my dearest. Oh, Misty. That's, yeah. Like, Desert Blossom is a bit closer to my my actual <laughs> voice, so it's definitely easy for me. All right. Okay. So mine's gonna be a little interesting because I'm gonna try something. I've been working on this voice, but I'm still... It's it, its a struggle. You see, Dragon Lord Mist... We'll get to the others in a moment. But Dragon Lord Mist is going to have essentially two voices. One of them is my live voice, where I try to, as best I can, create the voice without any usage of effects. And the other is essentially where I talk and I create the, essentially, sound and characteristics of the voice at a comfortable pitch. And then I pitch shift it down in um, before we like actually use the lines. So we're gonna try, we're gonna try and do the live one. Um, we'll see. So for Dragon Lord Mist, Dragon Lord Mist. <clears throat> ah, see if I can go down. I need some golem juice. <laughs> All right. Don't get down. Dragon. Golem juice, you'll regret it tomorrow. How dare you? How what? Do what? You'll regret golem juice tomorrow. Don't it's fine. Golem juice is fine. <laughs> Dragon you Lord. Juice and you're like, my voice. No, that was because I tried to do ASMR and didn't do it right, and the whispering apparently hurt my vocal cords. That was a different issue. <laughs> See, you're not moon dancer and you can't do it. <laughs> Pretty much. People keep saying I should do ASMR, but I'm like, uh no, because anytime I try and really do whispering, it doesn't work. So uh oops. 
Anyway, but that's the sudden point. So, Dragon Lord Mist. We're gonna call this the live voice. I need to work on it some more. But, um, this is the one. I just, honestly, his name is a good trigger word. Mortal Scum. Greetings, Mortal Scum. That's another one. And for the actual voice, this is... <clears throat> Dragon Lord. Why, hello there. This is Dragon Lord Mist in the actual voice. This is the one I use to pitch change down. Now, moving on from that. So next we have the gay boy who, um, let's be real. He's a gay boy. I don't really have a trigger word yet, and I'm still fine-tuning his voice. But Desert Rose, right? Yeah, well, that's a great Pretty voice, much. Stopping. You do the great voice, and it's just spot. <laughs> See, here's the thing for Desert Rose. I pretty much just visualize a drag queen, but like less expressive, and more emphasis on the gay and not the drag. <clears throat> <laughs> the drag queen, but the Why, gay, hello not there. the drag. I'm Desert Rose. Ah, oh, shoot! I completely forgot what was that original voice I had. Cause that's not it. it hello there. Like, hello there. Hello there. I'm Desert Rose, your gay boy. You kind of did like a. You kind of did like a valley girl. Did I? Hey y'all. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> y'all. Y'all. Okay. Wait. 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 We got this. We got this. Hey y'all. Uh. I'm a thing. I don't know. That one's still in in creation. Um. We're gonna worry about that one later. Then we have the other two, which is what was it? Uh. Sparkle Snap, who I'm still working on him, and Cinnamon Breeze, who's just a generic dad character, and this is my generic dad voice, naturally. That's right, Sappy. Right. Isn't one of your isn't one of your characters the dad of Cotton Candy? Maybe. <laughs> uh, y yeah, you're my dad. Cinnamon Breeze is my dad. Oh, why, hello there, Sport. How are you doing? You call me Sport. <laughs> Also, Cherry Blossom's hiding in her tree again. <laughs> oh, well, that's unfortunate. We'll have to you get the, um... Find me. Oh, no, we're having another parent-child episode again. Here's what we're gonna do. Okay, real quick. Real quick, we need, um, um, um... W w watch Craft. You, you, enter... Do your thing, and then we're all gonna get into character and do something stupid. Go. Yes. Okay, so, pretty much for Thistle Whistle... What I had to do to get into like the kind of voice that I auditioned with was, oh, uh, I pretty much like got inspired by the <laughs> by the Christmas special with this little whistle in it. <laughs> so, <laughs> so I had to like try and get it like like high enough for it to be like, but also still sound like a child. So like, um, hi, cafeteria, a nice place. So cute. And then just like with the whistling, it was just just like in between sentences. So like, uh, hang on, trying to make up something. Well, you know what? I'll just use the audition thing. So, okay. hello, cafeteria, <laughs> nice place, <laughs> something like that. Uh, wish I might. Well, pretty much just my normal voice, except a bit higher. So like. I told you guys it would work. Completely natural, you know? I'm just that kind of kind of breezy who just knows a lot about love. Do you do you have like similar like with Dragon Lord Mist, do you have one where it's like your natural voice and then it's yeah. modified and then one where it's like you try and recreate it? Well, considering Wish I Might is that type of character where he's a breezy, pretty much is like has to be auto-tuned. To like have that sort of like high pitched voice, then yeah. natural voice comes in for like later on. when I'm not going to spoil Ooh, what that what oh, that means. Sappy, oh. Sappy, I would, I would, I would like, I would like to see you try to do a breezy voice naturally. Yes. <laughs> okay. Okay. Wait. Wait. About high. How high is a breezy? Is this about oh good? Bar Hi, I'm a I'm a breezy, Bre breezy. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry, what? What are you doing? I don't get this. Okay, here we go. Oh, hello there. <laughs> Flying through the sky. We were just shooting up this, the, the bars. <laughs> wait, wait, you ready for this? Warning, warning headphone users. Wait, wait, wait. 
Oh, I can't get him to go that high. That's disappointing. Ignore that. That never happened. As for my <laughs> other characters, um, <laughs> Rhapsody Ribbons, well, pretty much it has to sound a bit like this. I won't snoot on my arm, dear. I'm just that kind of posh sort of posh. kind of guy. Posh. Just a little posh. Uh, tropical surprise. Well, I first when I first read the text, like the um, character bio, a bit of a snob. I was like thinking, oh, so pretty much like uh, Rainbow Dash sort of. So like, yeah. Ah, <laughs> 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 Daddy, <laughs> Bobby, North Korea. Wait, <laughs> what? <laughs> Ray for Ray that I couldn't quite hear you from the upstairs. When when Veruca says, <laughs> "I usually go," <laughs> it's from the uh, it's 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 Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. Chocolate Factory. Factory. Oh God! <laughs> it's 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 literally it's literally a yeah it's literally a line that Veruca says during the song. <laughs> Daddy, buy me North Korea. Daddy, buy me North when Korea. Veruca says. Oh my my God. Daddy, uh, I want a squirrel. Daddy, I want a squirrel. Daddy, I want a squirrel. Daddy, I want a squirrel. How much are the squirrels? <laughs> One million. Oh, the, wait, wait, wait. Let's see. Let's see. Wait, wait. Let me see if I can pull off. Um, fuck. Who was it? What was it? Oh my God. I'm I'm blanking on the actor's name. How am I blanking on his name? Johnny I should... Depp? Thank you, Johnny Depp. Let's see if I can pull off uh, Johnny Depp uh, Wonka. Um... <laughs> oh boy. Um, I'm so... Oh, I'm sorry. Those, those squirrels are not for sale. <clears throat> I just went off random memory. I don't even know how close that is. That was actually pretty close. He's, he, like, yeah. his, his Willy Wonka is very awkward and very like, um, <laughs> no, that's not for sale. <laughs> um, no, that's not for a sale. He's Sorry, kind of, he's kind of like that. Uh, he's kind of that like one weird kid in the corner. <laughs> that one, <laughs> that one weird kid who 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 created a giant blueberry child that's caused so much pain. <laughs> Not only on this server, but on many others. <laughs> on many servers alike. <laughs> Poor Max. <laughs> Poor Max. Finish off uh, the previous question regarding because I have like five characters. This is my last one. All right. Oh, oh yeah. yeah, yeah. Go ahead, go ahead. Well. Strawberry Swell, um, with the character description of that person basically being an inventor, I was sort of like thinking like, uh, Great Scott, like... Yes, yes. Great Scott, I am a scientist, not a medical person. Like, <laughs> what? <laughs> oh no, oh, not I... again! <laughs> ooh, ooh, I, I, I got a good quote for you. I'm not a quack, I'm a mad scientist. There's a difference. <laughs> I'm Where's not that a quack, Where's that I'm a mad from? scientist. Monsters versus aliens. Difference. <laughs> oh, yes. I'm not a quack. Really I'm oh, a man, that brings me back. I'm not a quack, I'm a... <laughs> um, what other questions can we do since we spent... Okay, okay, hours? we were gonna... We get, we get... Okay, we should, we should... We were gonna, like, get into character some stupid, but yes, I don't know. Yes, we, we need to, yes. Oh, we should... All right, all right. We need we need a um, scenario. Let's do like a random improv role play, stupid thing. Random scenario. Okay, someone hit me, hit me. Where are we located? Where? Walmart. Place. Island. Give me a place. What? Walmart. A desert I island. Okay, we're located in the singular building on a d remote island that apparently is a Walmart. <laughs> yeah. Okay. What is our goal? What are we doing? What are we doing? trying to get off this island with literally nothing in the walmart store no that's too obvious brush. that's too obvious that's too obvious it's got to be something 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 unique something that you wouldn't think to do we on a deserted island the, we want to we want to go to the moon <laughs> but we only have a string a toothbrush and a mattress all right we have string <laughs> a, a toothbrush and a mattress <laughs> need to find a plunger to get off the and a plunger okay all right all right all right so everyone pick one of your characters um, basic. Who are you gonna be? I'm gonna be Moon Dancer since that's the easiest voice for me to do, honestly. All right, I'll be the gay boy. Um, 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 um. Let's see. You, Bob and Fire. You only have one character, right? Yeah. Okay. 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 Bobbin doesn't have a choice. <laughs> Persecuty, pick a character. <laughs> Persecuty, pick a character. 
Thank you, Cherry Blossom! Oh, oh no. Obvious <laughs> reasons, right, Cotton Candy? Oh, God. Yay. <laughs> Watchcraft, hit us. I'll pick Wish I Might. Wish I Might. <laughs> Oh no, All right. we're 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 quite the we're quite the bunch today. Quite the bunch, quite the bunch, yes. Pony bunch. Pony bunch. I need some flowers. Does anybody know us? <laughs> okay, wait, wait, wait. Y'all just y'all just work on the ship on this one. I thought you were the candy! <laughs> Shut up! I want I'm gonna go into the floral section of that Walmart and see what they got. <laughs> They might have okay. some, um, um... I'm gonna go curl up on this mattress. Some I'm just fancy go roses. Sleep. No one wake... No one wake me up. I'm tired. I've been up all night doing who knows what. Oh, that's fine, sugar. You can you can sleep. You can sleep. Yeah, we'll, you can we'll let you know I'll once the rocket's the done. Come on, Cherry Blossom. Hey, Cotton hey, cut Candy, look at all these toys! Ooh, these are pretty... Oh, Why don't I see you on whack. the shelf? Oh, look! Oh, look! A giant sword! Whack! Uh, do you have money to pay for that stuff? <laughs> nope! Oh, that hurt. Here. <laughs> it's, Wait, it's why are we in the toy section if we're okay. looking there for a plunger? There are no cops here, so it's legal. There are no cops here, so it's legal. Okay, so I found an unnaturally large what? cactus. Um, can this help? <laughs> I think Does a rose... cactus can help launch people into the space. Does okay. Does it rose? I mean, if you could throw it hard enough, it'd probably hit the atmosphere, but... <laughs> After that, me, I'm not too sure. Me, okay, okay. Me, 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 you're one of you two. You're the twin. Crazy. Uh, you know, thinking about it now, I honestly think a Walmart isn't the best place to find like any parts for like a <laughs> spaceship. That's the point. We don't well, I mean, guys, 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 yet spaceship. I was somehow dragged okay. into this, so I guess I'm just going <laughs> to go through with that anyway. Might, 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 might. You and I, okay, buddy? You and I. We work together, okay? Because we both got wings. None of these guys do. So we both work together to get up there and we leave I them behind. Candy! Hey, I'll have you know, I may not have wings, yeah, but, but my personality soars. After we leave the atmosphere, there's gonna be no oxygen. We'll, we'll pretty much just... Alright, is anyone <laughs> here a Pegasus? <laughs> Wait, is Desert Rose a Pegasus? No, he's an no, Earth Bunny. Pony. Okay, as I said, I okay. literally got the <laughs> I got the character like a few days ago. <laughs> I'm a Pegasus. It's all right. It's see. all right. Even I'm confused with with which character is actually. Actually, I knew he wasn't a Pegasus. Unicorn. I was thinking unicorn. Is anyone a unicorn? No, I mean, I am. No, technically, rainbow no. is. Rainbow is. No, uh, cotton is. Yeah, cotton's a Wait, both cotton and rainbow. Wait, but you're not playing rainbow, so rainbow's not here. Okay, so cotton candy. Very so, lucky. So, yeah, rainbow's the only. Yeah, rainbow was the only person that was sane enough not to come. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Oh dear. The only reason she's here is because she didn't get her hoops dirty. Yeah, with all that sand, Mickey, you can dress. Right, fair enough. Oh, well, I, I mean, then again, I was dragged here only because, like, I thought it was some kind of like pretty custom, like, to go to space and using only parts from a Walmart. But On an abandoned island. <laughs> I, I was knew, told that okay? it was. I knew to this whole uh, party lifestyle. I was told. Thing. I Look, was I was, told was an isolated. I was told it was an isolated island, and I came here because I wanted some sleep. I was told there was going to be cute boys here, so um, I was disappointed. Who says I'm a cute boy? <laughs> no offense, sugar, but um, women oh, aren't I'm exactly sorry. my type. <laughs> you aren't oh, my sorry. type either. <sighs> okay, okay, wait, wait, wait. 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 Are you more powerful? No, 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 this guys, is important. Yeah, sorry, what? Guys, come on. Uh, let's just look at this magical map that we found. Where, where did you find that map? Where, where did the magic candy. map come from? What? Sugar, where did you cotton, find that map? Cotton! Hey, hey, cotton! Cotton! What? Mm -hmm. Do you think if I hit all these piñatas, do you think candy will come out? I'm sure something will uh, come out. I do anyway. <laughs> what are, are piñatas? It's me. Uh, um, they're basically they look like Cherry, a <laughs> Cherry Blossom, quit hitting her right now! <laughs> I don't know. Ooh, she probably I know. Kidding. Is that what a pinata is? Cherry Blossom, I have some bubble gum. 
go get it throws in the toilet section <laughs> toilet section <laughs> 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 Walmart has a specific toilet section <laughs> okay so so okay so so this is chaotic we need we need to make this logical and turn-based and we need um um does anyone have a dice. coin or a dice hang on let me check, let me check your hand Cut candy. check my mane where's the coin we gotta do this like we're all broke hey hold on hold on I have some dice. I can go. See I have a coin battery. Th that okay. Oh. Positive or negative? That's how we'll do it. <laughs> Let's see. I got a chainsaw. I got a hammer. Wait. I no, it always lands on positive. Guys. Never mind. It's not balanced. Um. Um. Uh, how do you get all that stuff? I hide it in my mane. You don't want to know what else is up is in there. Right, cutting candy. Oh. <laughs> how, how do you fit anything in that mane? You don't want to know. Magic? I don't wanna know. Excuse me. <laughs> All right, yeah. <laughs> I am just... The only thing I know about in regards to magic is that, you know, being a breezy, we, the only thing we need to do is just, well, pollinate the gardens and all that sort of stuff, like tend to the gardens. Oh, you can pollinate my garden if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> oh my god, that was... I'm sorry, that was a bit forward of me. He does a rose. Yes, sugar. He does a rose. Yes. He, um, if, if, <laughs> if you, if I, if, if I, if, you want to be my wig pony, man? Are you looking for a man? You want, they, no. Well, are you looking for a woman? Man, Wait, who are you like, looking for? I'm asking you, Desert Rose. You want to be my wing pony? Like, uh, yeah, hobby to you. Okay, well, first off, you're going to have to tell me who you're interested in, and then I'll tell you if I can help you. That is classified. Well, then I can't help you. But I'm sure you can. Oh, uh, are you sure about this? Are you sure about this, darling? You know this pony very well. Oh, do I? You do. I'm sorry? I just can't tell you because it works, but well, I can tell you. Well, here's the thing. Them. Here's the thing. Um, the person portraying Desert Rose knows very little about my canonical exactly. relations with That's anyone. That's exactly why I'm asking. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. Very well, very well, very well. I'll help you out. I'll help you out. I'll help you out. Perfect. That's all I needed to know. Max, write it down that Desert Rose is my wing pony. <laughs> <laughs> and so the plot thickens. I have, I have confirmation. <laughs> oh, uh, sweet. Oh. This just becomes like a big. Okay. <laughs> we want to have a look at it at the other one questions. big hyper dream. Oh yes, yes, yes. Yeah. Of course, of course. But yeah, we need some. We I'm gonna, questions. I'm gonna maintain character, of course, though. And by that I mean I'm just gonna stay my fabulous self. Let's see here. What um, kind of questions do we have? Mm. If you had to pick a favorite character that's not your own voice, who would it be? Well, let me think. So, what character do you like that is not your own voice? Anyone else want to go first? <laughs> I mean, I, I could. No one else wants to go. <laughs> oh, yeah. And first, I though, to I gotta think. Okay, all right. Uh, I guess my favorite is obviously our dragon lord. Thank you. Why? Like thank you. So You're welcome. Um, <laughs> thank you. Thank you. <laughs> and it, yeah, Sappy. Yes. If you see any more art of obviously him and Desert Blossom, thank Basic for doing his design. <laughs> Oh, I was waiting oh, no. for that dragon boy. I, I was literally as I was doing as I was doing Dragon Lord Mist design. I was literally messaging uh, Safi, being like, "What? What do you think Dragon Lord Mist would look like?" And he's like, "Make him scary. Make him cool. Make him like super badass." <laughs> <laughs> I, I mean, that's only kind of true. And then, it, no, she, and 
I messaged Max, and Max is like, make him like pastel colors, make him very bright. Okay, this here's the thing. He's based off of. Here's the thing. Here's the thing. In my defense, okay, <laughs> this was before I really took the time to like try and figure out some backstory and like understand him as a character, and I was just going off of the very loose description <laughs> Max gave me, right? And that was he is. If I remember quickly, I can almost quote it. It was the ruler of all of the dragons that would want nothing more than pony villain ashes. Does that does that seem like a pastel fabulous cutesy character to you? No. Oh god. Oh, exactly. No. No. Ron's more like the myth of him. I'd still like to see pony villain ashes. I'll have you I think know. I did a pretty good job evening out the badassery to uh, Max's Some demands. I think you did awesome. Oh my I still gosh. feel like I feel like Dragon Lord Mist should be a Cindere. I have yet to convince um, Max of this though. <laughs> <laughs> like it just seems natural for him, but canonically, this is not true yet. <laughs> yeah, yet. Yet. <laughs> Eventu um, eventually, I'll break Max. He was, I, guess, he, I, yeah, I guess I assume done. his I assume his wife is Senpai. Um, pretty much, pretty much. Me? Pretty much. I'm, I'm, I'm not, I'm not daughter. It's not like I like you or anything. I mean, I know we're his, married, his but... Uh... His, da uh, his daughter comes up to him, Yo, Dad, I, yo, Dad, I want some love. And, and like, Dragon to be Lord, fair... Dragon Lord Miss is like, I don't, I don't want a baka. To be fair, when I say Sundre, I'm using that very loosely. I don't mean, like, the full-out stereotypical. I mean, like, loosely, his character has that, like, Sundre vibe. Oh, no, no, no. Cause like the whole family is like yonder vibe, super <laughs> vibe. Dure Wait, vibe. what about kimono? What about kimono? What would kimono be? Dure, dure. That's that's uh. That's dure, dure. Like cold and heartless. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> oh, oh, that reminds me. Oh, I think I figured out. Okay, to answer your previous question, um, I'm gonna have to go with kimono just simply because corpse bunny. I don't know how she pulls off that vocal fry at that range with, like, compared to her natural <laughs> voice. Like, mm. it, it, I love her. Like, it literally sounds like Teen Titans Raven. I, oh my god! And like, awesome. she pulls it off so yeah. fluidly. <laughs> At first, I just genuinely thought that was her natural voice, and like, the character just happened to match her voice. And then I heard her speaking normally. Oh, yeah. I'm like, holy crap! Oh no, you're, you're like her voice is down here. Her voice is like this. Like, this is her voice. This is a really bad voice, but this is her like, voice. Like her natural and voice. Then her voice is actually like right up here. And <laughs> It's like it's like don't get me wrong, she has a deep voice um for someone feminine or but it's like it still is genuinely mind boggling that she manages to pull it off that flawlessly and just like drop in and out of character like that. Oh yeah. And and she doesn't need, I, from my knowledge, she doesn't really need any kind of pick I know the one line oh, she has fun with a few poems. <laughs> oh god. Um I, I'm just waiting to character. see her sing in that voice. <laughs> I, think, I think you know what my favorite character was. Mm -hmm. My favorite character has to be Sun Shimmer. That's not my own. Not oh, because so I'm pretty. biased. <laughs> she's pretty. Yeah, obviously. But like, I'm also like every like <laughs> Na Nancy and I. Nancy and I are uh, vibe together, and we hang out, and we both made like. Even before anything was like set in stone, we both <laughs> joked about stuff and like, I, I, it's more or less the voice actress that makes Sun Shimmer so lovable. But like, also if I'm gonna go off of voice actor standards, I have to like, character wise, I don't know how I feel about Star Song, but voice actress wise, freaking Maeve hits it. <laughs> <laughs> uh huh. Like, have you ever heard Maeve's take on, like, Star Song? It's... Honestly, Maeve is, like, no offense to anyone else here, Maeve is probably one of the most talented voice actors here, like, in the project. Mm, yeah. Oh my god, oh, yes. Indeed. Like, we love you all equally, but Maeve has, like, literal, like, she's able to make a character that sings every octave speak. It's, like, it is just impressive. Like... If anyone needs some vocal coaching, go to Maeve. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Maeve is your gal. Go to Maeve. Even if it's like, Maeve is just talented. <laughs> yeah. It's interesting because I joined the project and she is by far the most chaotic person here. She's also oh, yeah. 
but I guess not, she's like one of the she's also like one of the smartest people. She's like a PhD. So. Wait, seriously? <laughs> yeah, she's a PhD. Like has or is working on one? She she, she did therapy. She not th- did therapy. She's uh she she has like um mental stuff. Like not ment- okay. mental. <laughs> I mean, you're not wrong. <laughs> this is the I, same person who willingly married a blueberry in a Shrek themed wedding. <laughs> it, it was glorious. Um, no, she is like she is like a she is like um a therapist training stuff. Did not psychologist, know that. that's the word. Psychologist. She went for Did school for psychology. That. that was like one of her things, I think. Man, she got she it all like, figured out. Meanwhile, I'm sitting here like, um, I might do audio engineering maybe or voice mind acting you. or she maybe also, i'll just stick with computer science to, i don't know mind you she also went to college when she was like 14 holy damn mm. excuse me what yeah she she went she's 18 and she went to call like she she applied when she was like 13 i feel like she purposely made like like dumbs herself down just to like not freak everyone out and I intimidate think she does because she doesn't want us to expect what? anything more we don't suspect. What? She's the big brain of the project. She is. And my Max is still eats. Meanwhile, meanwhile, Max is eating banana peels and orange pulps. <laughs> <laughs> Turning into a freaking blueberry. <laughs> he literally texted me, like, and said, "Is it not normal to eat?" The <laughs> banana peels. Banana peels. <laughs> and I was like, like no. it's a, I was like, what? Like a few weeks ago, right? Like maybe a month I ago. Was like two weeks ago, and his entire world changed because he thought you had to eat the whole fruit. <laughs> it's like some things I get that, like, like, spe- like I remember I was like that with boiled peanuts because I thought part of the reason you boil them is to make the shell like soft and edible. But it's like yeah, bananas. Okay, but 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 okay. Also, but you know what really pisses me off more about this whole thing is that he would he would peel the banana fully, eat the inside of the banana, and then eat the peel. Wait, so he would? Uh, oh my, why? Uh, so he'd like eat the banana normally, and then come back and say, "Ooh, time for seconds. Let me eat the peel." <laughs> <laughs> We love Max. Max is great. Mm, that was a delicious. Yeah. But, Max, uh, but Max, but Max is also like super smart. Too. <laughs> I mean, that's fair. Both, like people, like the admins here are super smart, but also gonna be like super like. I think we me, we I'm, all like, of us really simultaneously smart. are like big brain, but radiate crack energy. <laughs> I am just crack energy. Have you not stayed? Have you not stayed? We talked about holes one day <laughs> for a straight hour. We got really philosophical, okay? We was talking about the fourth spatial dimension, okay? <laughs> I saw that and I was thinking, should I join? <laughs> we just wait, hold up, hold up, hold up. We gotta get this hypercube. We go, okay. Okay, hold up, hold up, hold but up. We literally, we literally, oof. Okay, hold up, hold up. See, I I feel like I'm the most crackheaded out of us all. <laughs> I gotta go, guys. I yeah. see you around. Hope you I'll had some you fun. Next time. Oh, if you win. All excited. Can't I can't wait. Can't wait for the next one. Oh God. Okay, so about That's hypercubes. <laughs> okay, so um, so like here, here's the thing. I've once in my life been able to like. Like you can, I can kind of visualize four spatial dimensions, right? But like, the struggle is visualizing it, and like imagining how you manipulate. Cause see, this thing is rotating. That's all it's doing. Mm. Wait, is everyone watching? You guys even yeah. watching the stream? Okay, we got three. Okay, see, we what I do, what I'm doing is I'm just watching one vertex. Okay, so let's follow one and around. And just watching it rotate. Let's follow it around. And just following it. And when you watch the oh, one I can't vertex, keep track of him. Okay, hold up, hold up, hold up. I'm, I'm, I'm keeping track if of If you watch the one vertex, you can kind of see where how it's shaped. Interesting. Oh, that's so funky. Because it's literally know, just right? moving in a circle. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like, it feels like the entire thing is rotating along two axes. Yeah, no. Like, if you watch one, if you literally watch only it's one. It's literally... You... 
Because it's like I'm tracking it with the mouse, and you see it's it's just moving at a. Oh, that is so funky. Yeah. And wait, no, no, no. It's because it, wait, no, 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 wait, no. It's because it's like rotating a certain amount. So it's like in the time it takes to make a full s cycle, it rotates completely yeah. around. I think. Damn. See, like I'm, I'm smart. I could be smart. I'm one. Of, I could be a smart admin. <laughs> I'm gonna break my brain. I remember I once, I once in my life managed to not just like visualize it, but like I could imagine and like visualize how to manipulate four dimensional objects and like how you would move through four dimensional space. And it's like you can it's kind like of. It's really difficult. It's like, mind you, we're looking at a 4D image in a 2D area. That is that is another key point. This is obviously not actually four dimensional. It's two dimensional, but it's a two-dimensional projection of a four-dimensional object. And it's so funky. We're gonna break Dave, everyone's brain. My mind is going. Because <laughs> see, here's the thing. My mind's going. Okay, hold it's up, like, hold up, hold up. Let me, Steffi, let me find a normal cube. has been here for my late-night conversations. Oh, ah! No! Go away, Wicca. Okay, there we go. So is Craig. Okay, okay, okay. So here we go, here we go. Math time with Safi. Geometry, let's go. Okay, so visualize this. So you have zero dimensions and then one dimensions, whatever. So oh, we're, I see it. we're taking the same shape and creating it with increasing number of spatial dimensions. So you have a two dimensional square, right? We'll start there because one and zero dimensions are like, it's, it's a line and a dot. <laughs> That's boring. But um, so two dimensional space, if you take just a basic square, what do you what happens when you create three dimensions well you take that square and you essentially extend it along a third axis when projected onto two-dimensional space we get this classic shape that everyone's familiar with we call it a cube but remember this is not actually two-dimensional or it's not actually three dimensional. Oh, i see it i actually see it i was not, i'm not lying this time i see it okay so like i get it so this is how i'm gonna explain it because i got small brain okay so like how safi said there's a fourth dimension like there's a third dimensional which is like height length and width right that's a three dimensions but in the fourth dimension there's height length width and angle and like it, in like if you look at them they're like every face inside the fourth dimensional one is like a square Wait, where'd you get angle? Because, like, the one, like, it's like, okay, so, like, I can't I'm just talk, visualizing like, the W axis. Because <laughs> you got your... You're visualizing the W axis. Because you I got see, your X, but, but I, Y, and you got your Z, and then you got your W. <laughs> see, but what I'm visualizing is, like, I got, I, is I got, like, a line going diagonal. I got a line going straight. Like width wise, a line going straight length wise, and a line going straight height wise, and then on top, and then from that, I got a line going diagonal, like on an angle. <laughs> okay, that's bro. the fourth. That's the fourth dimension. <laughs> the angle. The angle. Okay, but it's like oh, 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 oh. Percy Kitty's gonna come back real quick, real quick. Wait, wait, wait. Um, my um, brain is just going smush. Uh, You're welcome. This is the stuff shoot. I think about at two o'clock in the morning. Go move. Um, Why do you think about this at two in the morning? <laughs> Reasons. Percy Kitty, what do you think of um, the hypercube? Explain what you see. Explain the geometry of it. Um. So... What? And loading. Okay. Okay. Look okay. at this. Look at this. What do you but see? But like my brain. Okay. So like that's how my <laughs> brain works. I need. There's like different, it's on a different axes, and the axes is the angle. The fourth dimension is the angle. <laughs> okay. The fourth a dimension is the diagonal. Hmm. Okay, but it's like okay, okay, wait, wait, wait. Let's visualize this. So basically, you just are drawing. Here's here's what I'm noticing. As you move up with each additional spatial dimension, all you're doing is you're essentially duplicating what's already there and then connecting it with. Um, with lines connecting each corner with its corresponding corner, um, and that in with creating a new line of the same length in the extra spatial dimension. So, like you have a two dimensional object to a three dimensional object, right? Well, you have the square, right? Classic square. But then when you extend it, the square into three dimensional space, you create another square with like the same length as like one of the sides of the square, 
but like goes further back and then it's like my brain's broken just we're gonna break yeah. everyone's brain not, you're, you're, you're not next the only question one. next question yeah let's move on let's move on let's move on <laughs> And we don't um, want the viewers to get their brains smushed. They're gonna get yes. their brains smushed anyway. Uh, how about this one? Out of all the cast design, Ooh. who's your favorite appearance-wise? Ooh, Ice Terrier. Mm. Why is Terrier right off the bat? I love it. It's the way, it's just the way she's like posed. It's just like confident royalty with the wings just flaring out like she can take on the I, world. I love it. She she does take on the world. She, her the whole story is her. <laughs> Okay, wait, 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 where's exactly. the... Okay. Like, like, if we ever decide to do, like, one of those, like, cool posters with, like, all the characters and, like, the baddies and all that, Wise Terrier should be in that pose, just, like, front center with that pose. Mm -hmm. We'll just spike, just on our back, be like, yeah, let's go, horsey! <laughs> <laughs> right, let's go. Oh, yeah. There we go, there it is. <laughs> There it is. Hey, Wisteria. How are you, honey? <laughs> Thanks to the great concept artist, Teresa. <laughs> Honestly, yeah. I'm going to have to say yes. I'm, partial, I'm partial to Starcatcher. I'm partial to Starcatcher. <laughs> I know, right? Starcatcher? She looking fun. Mm -hmm. She beautiful. You know? She like, got them opal wings. Like, I'm just, like, looking. Oh, let's see. Can I? Okay. I have to, I have to do the shift scroll. Okay, that's fine. I'm just looking at like all of the fine intricate details. Like honestly, look at this. Like all of the like the colors complement each other so well. It's like even like these subtle like um highlights on like the 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 the, the that the wing. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I right? Like a gem encrusted like object. Like those well, look like wings... actually, it could be like gems. Well, that's the oh. point. Her wings are like opal. It's just like, she's got, like opalized wings. Her wings are straight up opal and it's beautiful. <laughs> I, I also like the wavy locks of the hair. It just reminds me of like um Celestia mind from you. G4. Oh yeah. yeah. Mind mm -hmm. you, mind you also, she like she the trans colors. <laughs> and the I mean you're not wrong. <laughs> it's like slightly different shades, but I mean you're not wrong. I'm not wrong. <laughs> Wait, it was another good one. Um, also, also reminds me of um the, that colored toothpaste. Does anyone know about that? I was gonna, okay. I was gonna, I, I almost said that, but I was okay. like, no, I'm not gonna say that. <laughs> um, I, 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 say, I, I say it for you. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest. I really like Moon Dancer. Like Moon Dancer's whole like face on oh, like yeah. her, especially on the her. concept art. Because like, hold up, hold up, let me pull it up. The concept art from Moon Dancer, like the I have voice crack, the cloud peaceful cloud but i mean yeah i mean who couldn't love that face though that face that face like look at her face it's someone such a who's mood. Just done. Mm -hmm. she's just vibing that's the face of a mare who just wants to just go to bed she's just, just vibing. Mare yeah hey, exactly like, remember the valentine thing you did of uh moon dancer that we ended, we ended up doing pickup lines back and forth for each other <laughs> yeah like i woke up for you that romantic <sighs> A mood. I got, I got, I got all the pickup lines, baby. Don't worry. I'm a, <laughs> I'm a, I'm a, I'm a pickup line master. I got one more. Ooh, swoon me. Okay. Are you water? Cause you're making me thirsty. Oh. Ooh. <laughs> Wait. That's gonna be some tea soon if you don't come here. <laughs> I just real OBS. What is OBS doing? Why can I move my mouse outside of? The can you guys see that? I can see your mouse, yeah. How am I moving it out of there? It's like, look where it actually is. Right, this is the actual mouse. And then I move it, like, underneath the monitor. Like, here's the actual monitor I'm visualizing. Now it's on a different monitor that's underneath the monitor that's, like, sharing the screen. <laughs> <laughs> Mood. Now it's, like, hovering, oh, yeah, no. that, now it's hovering over trippy. Discord. That's trippy. <laughs> That's you know whatever whatever. So I guess OBS to, uh, answered the question. <laughs> Wait, what? Regarding to favorite designs. Uh, okay. Uh, but if I was to actually choose one that was not my own, I, I I'll come back to that. You guys go. Okay. 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 Bobbin. Um. Okay. I think I really like Mono's. 
Honestly, I was gonna say that's <gasps> another one of my Honestly. Favorites. Kimono. Mm. <laughs> oh my oh, sweet this... daughter. I, I okay. So when I was oh, doing Dragon Lord daughter. Mist, when I was doing Dragon Lord Mist, Max was like, okay, so basically make him fluffy. And I'm like, fluffy, okay. It's so like make him real fluffy long boy. Like he doesn't even give me words. He was just giving me like fluffy long boy. Like, <laughs> fluffy long boy. And I'm like, so a Chinese water dragon. And he's like, yeah, because she's like um, she like kimono has like some kind of like Asian descent, and I was like, okay, cool. And but like, honestly, like look at her, like it, you could literally tell that if she was human, what her like, like just what her like attributes would be. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Our darling daughter. Yeah. Her torn is like really cool as well. Like it sets her out from like all the other oh, yeah. acorns in the series. Cause it's like it's mm -hmm. like is she, is she an alicorn? I guess she is. Wait, is that a horn or like okay, wait, is that like the horn as in magic horn or horn as in no, it's the dragon? She, so horn. she starts off as a unicorn, so she's a unicorn, right? Yeah, because I, I guess, am. I guess she is technically an alicorn. Cause she does have magic. Wait. She's, would she be she's would she be considered an alicorn? Because the Her wings horn? are part of the dragon. So it's not pony wings. So does that te is she technically an alicorn? But thing is, technically, pony wings, aka Pegasus wings, are not even pony wings. They're bird wings. I mean, true. <laughs> so, like, as long as they're wings, they're wings. So, does that mean she's like some sort of alicorn? Like, I guess. Horn makes me think of the Kirin from G four. Wait, wait. Oh yeah, Kirin from G four. The the horn, her horn. Oh yeah. Wait. So does that mean that you can make alicorns just with inter interspecies mingling? We don't have to discuss with Max about this. <laughs> this is a Max question. Yeah. We don't have lore person yet. This is a Max we're gonna question. yeah. We're gonna have to. I'm gonna I'm gonna get back to Max. We're gonna have an answer to this. This is important. <laughs> yes, we need we need answer. We need answer for this. <laughs> <laughs> Um, all right. That, that one, that that one day, they'll how they, they're all testing over his a certain by part of his. It's just, you no, know, that was funny. <laughs> and I got me thinking, if they actually did, you know, how is she still alive? Wait, how's who? Mm -hmm. What? My brain's slow. <laughs> I just that zoned out. Yep, basically. With, with your video, the the Griffins and the Breezy. Guys, oh God, go. we don't talk oh, about that. Video. All right, go real quick. All right, see you around, fam. All right, all right. We don't talk about that. We don't talk about. Before Max's idea, got me thinking. If you know, before this is before his idea. How is she still alive? Okay, so um, I like Spike as well. <laughs> I might be a little. Am I gonna have to pull up that video? Spike. I'm gonna have to pull up that video. I be, Hold on. I might be a little biased because I designed Spike, but I'm also not gonna lie. I also like uh, December Delight's design too. Oh yes. Oh, he, he looks so handsome. Uh, give me a sec. Hold up. December Delight. I don't wait. Where is he? I but I'm gonna be. He's in um design input. Just scroll up a little bit here. I'm looking in concept art. No, he's on a concept art. Uh, da, da, da. Here. Here, one second. I'm going to link you. Hold on. Uh, Safi, where are you on my friends list here? You should be here soon. Safi, are you my friend? I Safi, you're my friend. I saw the spy got, and I'll... Yeah, I did like... Like ask you as like a suggestion, like would it be cool to just like add like a bow tie? Like I was thinking, like maybe like a purple tie, just like match with like the scales. Like oh that. yeah, no. Uh, if I was gonna give him a bow tie, I'd probably make it more uh, pink. Like so, if you so if you look at the first image I sent, it's like all my concept photos, that, like uh, references, I guess, right? Yeah. And oh, what, the middle one there is the actual spike, like the spike from G three. 
that yeah. Max told me to reference. And as you can tell, I got like I got the scales, I got like I got all the colors at least referenced except the bright pink. And that is the ugliest color with this color scheme I've ever seen. Oh. Kind of reminds me. Wait, of, you're, um, are you talking about spider. that? That that pink right there? Yes, it, that pink is so ugly. Oh. Don't you agree? And I tried my best uh-huh. to make the sp- like make the spikes pink or make something on him pink like that, but I couldn't. I just couldn't. I mean, yeah, it was. It's like and you so, might but, could get. I don't know. But if you notice, I kind of made a slight pink yellowish tinge to the horn to the like things. But, like, it's oh yeah, it's oh yeah, it's subtle, it's, but it's there. It, it's so subtle. That reminds me almost so of little. like um Spyro. That was uh, one of the concepts I had of uh, Spyro here. If you look at the top, that was one of the references. Yeah, I saw that. It was yeah. A, yeah, so one of the, it was it was more or less to pick the spikiness of like some of the adult versions people have a Spyro. Oh yeah. Because I noticed something in there, and when I was looking at all like the previous generations of Spike, uh, lots of them weren't actually spiky. Like the only reason he gets his name in G three is because it spikes on his tail, and there's three of those. Spike <laughs> in G. Th- Four doesn't have much, and I don't know. And Spike in G one like has nothing except like his head and stuff. But this one, I made sure to make him a super spiky. <laughs> He's the spiky boy, reptilic, reptilic like. Well, yeah. That's word. <laughs> you can also tell that there's a little bit of a raptor. Kind of. I don't know. That's just how I did Spike. <laughs> I like. I, I really like Spike's it's really good. It's and really I like good. His, yeah, and I really like his, uh, how his, like, little markings are on his body. But, granted, I also really like, um, Thistle Whistle's design. Ah, uh, yes. I like zebra. a lot of designs. <laughs> the zebra boy. The, the old zebra. Yeah, the boy. zebra boy. <laughs> well, let me see if I can pull him up real quick. The amount of photos, the the photos of like the long tongue, I was just like, yep, okay. And then the other one, which I'm not going to mention because this is a kid's podcast. Oh no. <laughs> this, is, this is for all ages. I'm not going to mention what's in the photo, but. Oh god. No, just. <laughs> and Okapai's tongue is meant to clean their face and reach like high yeah. <laughs> And the reason, the reason I looked into this, you can think Percy. <laughs> you think oh, Percy. <laughs> Percy told asked me what would what would Dragon Lord's miss tongue be, and I'm like, you, maybe like, oh, no. usually like in dragons, it would be like some sort of like snake, like reptilian, right? But I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna try and look for actual like tongue. And I went through like weird tongues that you don't expect website, like on BuzzFeed or something. And I was scrolling through. <laughs> That was literally the first thing that popped up. Wait. We're just... Oh. <clears throat> Everyone just went silent. I thought my computer froze for a second. I was about to have a heart attack. <laughs> we're not live. No, we're not. What's... Is basic... Did basic just cut out? No, I think... Maybe it was bobbin? Basic right. there. Oh, she's out. <laughs> there she is. Maybe. Okay, I completely just dropped out. Hi. I'm going to lower the bit rate just a little and hope that fixes it. What just happened? What did you, okay, what did you guys hear? Because I said my whole story and then no one was here. What happened? Where, where did I stop last? <laughs> you were saying how... Your, I asked you about his tongue. You said it was cat like, so you're looking on like BuzzFeed. Okay, so I was looking on BuzzFeed and I was looking at and one of the and one of the weird ones is an Okapai's tongue. And it was a photo of the Okapai wrapping its to- like wrapping its tongue around its face to clean it, right? And um and I told Max, yo, we have an Okapai. What if he had a tongue like this? Just as like a joke or whatever. And Max was like, Yes, it's canon. <laughs> Just out of nowhere. (laughs) 
just an okapai tongue and just just one scene where like just just <laughs> it's great you're welcome you're welcome that this whistle has this <laughs> I hope it's not heavily just referenced every episode. <laughs> no, Max said Max said it wouldn't be referenced often. It'd just be like a slight thing. <laughs> oh, thank goodness! All right. Well, but I, will, but I, I like his design, and he's going to be one of the next characters uh, designed, which I'm excited for. I think that is probably a good place to end it. What do you guys say? Yeah. All right. Well, um, this was more successful than I expected. <laughs> but yeah, yeah. Um, we'll upload it or something. I don't know. We'll find out. Um, yeah. Thanks for watching this. If you're actually watching this, we 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 do things. We do stuff. What is this chaos? What is this? What what are these podcasts? Honestly, at this point, I don't know. Just, Who just knows how long of, they're going to be up for? Because these are. <laughs> who knows how long these are gonna be up for anyway <laughs> uh this is just chaos all right um who knows if they're gonna stay <laughs> stick around watch them now before they go maybe who knows before we start the, the whole podcast they, and just start over before before they mysteriously disappear <laughs> well, all right because we, talk, <laughs> because we talk about a bit a little spicy stuff <laughs> all right well thank you for watching and good day